Hi, this is Jen from TTPM, and I'm here with the Razer E100 Glow Electric Scooter. To get started, you'll first need to put it together. It's a straightforward process, but it will definitely require adult assembly. Then you'll need to charge it up, which takes about 12 hours, although the company recommends a max charge time of 24 hours for recharging. Once it's charged up, you are ready to ride. To use, flip on the on-off switch located on the scooter's base and flip up the kickstand. The scooter features a sturdy wide platform that you can balance on. Once on, you'll need to kickstart it on the ground while engaging the throttle located on the right handlebar. Now one thing that is important to note is that the scooter must be moving at 3 miles per hour with the throttle engaged before the motor will activate. At this point, you can cruise around at a solid 10 miles per hour for up to 40 minutes of continuous use. Once it starts to make more of a pup put put sound as you ride, you'll know it's time to recharge. Each time you twist the throttle to accelerate, it will also engage a cool blue LED light to give off a glowing effect as you ride. You'll kind of look like you're traveling at the speed of light. This new feature really adds to the classic fun of this scooter and might even encourage a bit more imaginative play in the process. To brake, simply give the brake lever a squeeze. The scooter will ease into a steady stop. A couple things to note, as with any electric scooter, there is a learning curve, especially when it comes to accelerating and engaging the motor. However, with practice, kids will easily get the hang of it. We also recommend always wearing the proper safety gear while riding. The scooter has a weight limit of 120 pounds and is made for ages 8 and up. So if you're in the market for a new mode of transportation that's as cool looking as it is to ride, head over to TTPM for more information on the Razer E100 Glow electric scooter or subscribe to our YouTube channel for more great reviews every day.